The description of the item says the ultimate test of mind over matter. Sims have been firewalking as long as they've had feet, which given their propensity for firewalking was not always a given. Will you cleanse your soul or send your souls on the coal stroll? Damn, the Sims team has bars. God damn. Okay. <laughs> Hello everybody and welcome back to yet another episode of Let's Play The Sims 3 Island Paradise. I am finally back at home from college, so if you notice some differences in sound, this also means that I will resume streaming The Sims 3 or The Sims 2 or any Sims related game on Saturdays at 7pm EST. So please come along, this will be this upcoming stream, this upcoming Saturday is going to be my return stream. I'm so excited and I hope to see you guys all there welcome back guys i hope you have been doing well in the last episode we had skip go diving at the rocky reef which is the beginner diving location if i can find it also now that i'm back at home i don't know if i like i don't have all my saves or save fixes applied to this computer because i have two different computers for like my university and then back at home but like when i go in like map mode I, it might also have to do with like a, needing a total ton reset but do you see like the lag that's there i don't know anyway the last episode we went to rocky reef and skip met a mermaid now because they're both skip and meadow are both having a midlife crisis right now they keep getting wishes to flirt with other people like meadow yeah flirt with someone else a lot of you in the comments were saying that you know since skip has met this brand new mermaid girly her name is maya ocean which i think is such a cute name maybe he wants to have an open relationship or meadow and him want to have an open relationship and i absolutely like i, I adore that idea i don't know if i've ever done an open relationship type of thing before i just don't know how that would work because the game how it is right now see in other sims games like i think in the sims 2 and in the sims 4 there's mods that allow you to kind of simulate an open relationship by having they get basically like a passive trait or whatever that will make them so they won't be jealous when their significant other flirts with someone else oh my god salty and star <laughs> we'll get there in a second but what i wanted to see is i think enrolls might have something like that so i'm gonna go in to intermediate no it's not in our intermediate and advanced is it yeah it's an advanced we're gonna go change traits and there might be something in here that will let him not get jealous if meadow were to flirt with someone else so i'm gonna look through these here i know that awesome mod has a lot of this but i've since i've taken awesome mod out of my game haven't been able to obviously apply that it doesn't look like there's anything that i could give him in here you can also kind of see like the inner workings of the sims which i think is really interesting so for example if you guys don't know this in the sims 3 showtime there is a genie lamp that comes comes with that it's like one of the things you can have your sims buy when you wish for one of those it applies a hidden trait to your sim so this is really cool so it, it basically gives your sim these markers so obviously you can see wish for beauty wish for happiness wish for large family these are all wishes that you can wish for at the genie it basically goes in here that's how the game tells your sim that you have wished for you know long life large family happiness beauty etc etc so it's kind of cool to see the inner workings of how the game works there's a lot of stuff like that oh also when your sims have low hygiene it applies this invisible trait stinky sim that's what basically makes your sim have the green you know little armpit uh stink markers coming out of their armpits so it's really cool i honestly love to kind of look at like how the game devs went about making this game i think it's like one of the most fascinating parts of this game because you have to remember the landscape in which the sims 3 was made it was being developed in like 2007 2008 and it came out in 2009 so they obviously were working on it well before 2009 so for them to have done it so simply like literally all they did to do those things was make it an invisible trait marker which i think is so fascinating so anyway very interesting also in the last episode as i'm sure you guys can see salty and star got together now their their relationship i feel like is going to be very fickle fickle meaning it's very uh malleable i used the one difficult word to describe another difficult word i'm sorry this is like a very high school relationship to me but a lot of you were saying that i should keep river out of their relationship like i should let okay i need to lock his door because they're gonna keep walking in tyson's room hold on i also gave tyson like a little room makeover so that's why he's like checking the new stuff out in there yeah they're very much so giving me high school relationship but like they're giving me high school relationship but they would like mature into like being actually really a nice couple together and then a lot of you are saying that you know maybe river kind of turns against star i was asking what i should do in regards to the salty star relationship because obviously river had a crush on salty his cousin star kind of just swooped in and took her away which i 
think is uh, very interesting. Actually, I wanted to bring up a comment by Chris. Chris, I know you, I featured you a lot in these videos. Chris says, did River ever express interest in Salty? Like narratively, yes, but in game, they're just friends or at the very least, not exclusive. I say let Star have her and turn River into an incel. <laughs> the incel part, I don't know how I'm gonna replicate that in The Sims. But yeah, I was also thinking that letting Star and Salty just be a thing would be good. And then maybe later in life, I, I don't know. They also, he wasn't very attracted to her. So I think what I may have to do is I'm just gonna have to find a mermaid in town at this point and just age them down or change their aging or whatever. I don't I don't really know. I guess we'll see though, but I guess Salty and Star, they're on hot water right now because damn, they're already fighting. Honestly, I feel like it'd be kind of hard to be in a relationship with Salty because she has so many negative traits. She's like evil and she has like all these, all these bad traits that I don't know. I don't think I'd wanna be in a relationship with someone that's evil, but uh who knows i actually wanted to quickly just come back over here to the resort and take a little look at it obviously i haven't worked on it in a couple episodes back here was supposed to be oh we have a guest are you oh elton lacy is chilling out here this must be so peaceful just like overlooking the water you know gaming a little bit playing some fifa all that kind of stuff but we do have a little bit of extra money so what i did want to do is i wanted to come here and do a little bit of resort management so we can go into buy mode a lot of you were telling me that if you buy by the firewalk walking station it actually gives your sims like a major boost in resort quality so i'm going to go to the island paradise tab here and i'm going to buy the fire walking uh fire pit i guess is what it's called coal stroll fire walking pit now if you don't know what this is they have these a lot at like resorts and that sort of thing basically it's just like hot coals i looked it up and it's like a historical cultural thing so the more you know the description of the item says the ultimate test of mind over matter sims have been firewalking as long as they've had feet which given their propensity for firewalking was not always a given will you cleanse your soul or send your souls on the coal stroll damn the sims team has bars god damn okay so anyway, i'm gonna put that there i don't know where i want to put it in long term but i mean i guess this can just chill here you can adjust the temperature hot cool or scorching we can do firewalking so we'll have to check that out now the last thing i did want to mention and a lot of you have been telling me about this which is really cool offhand acid on twitter shout out to you acid you're always in my streams and watching my videos so thank you but acid told me that there's actually a mod that fixes the diving caves so in the last episode if you don't remember skip was trying to dive at rocky reef and it has one of those rabbit hole caves now unfortunately the sims team for whatever reason i don't know if they played didn't play test or whatever play test the caves but your sim will actually get reset and get thrown back into the world and not be underwater and it's a whole debacle whenever they decide to go and dive in one of those caves now there's actually a mod that fixes this it's by shimrod the lovely shimrod shimrod was an amazing sims 3 mod creator and i think i don't think they make mods anymore i think they also made sims 2 mods shimrod made a fix for the cave and i installed it so hopefully that will work so thank you to everyone i know people in the comments were telling me and also acid dm'd me on twitter but it is really great so thank you guys so much for bringing that to my attention i had no idea that that mod existed but we'll see if next time we send skip off to go diving if that mod works and hopefully it will make those rabbit hole caves usable because we definitely need uh we definitely need that so we're just having everyone sleep right now and now i don't know if i should lock this in so i don't think meadow would be the one oh i also gave meadow makeover we'll see that in a second here though if you guys know how i would do an open relationship type of thing um where the sims wouldn't get jealous at each other then please let me know because i would really like to kind of tell that story with meadow and skip but it is looking like that's not going to be an option right now unless i find a way to put them in like a thing where they wouldn't get jealous at each other so yeah we'll have to see if anyone in the comments has like a mod or just a suggestion of how i would uh do that that would be that would be wonderful it is sunday so i guess i mean does skip work today he does not work today okay perfect so maybe we can have him go diving in a little bit he is sick and i have enros vector which makes my sicknesses like 10 times worse so he's gonna get really tired really fast which is not good if he's gonna be swimming because i mean he can drown which is yeah we don't we don't want him to drown River is actually not sick. He's the only one in his family that is not sick. I guess maybe his like plant sim superior genetics had him get over the sickness quicker than his family is because they are slugging by. Like they still have two days left. I'm just ready for them to stop being sick. Everyone in this household besides River is sick. So I think he's the one that like brought the illness in the household and then he got over it the fastest. But yeah, it's, it's quite, it's quite bad. So now that we've kind of decided that River isn't going, why did it say replace for that? That's so weird. Now that we decided that River isn't going to be going after Salty, we need to have 
have him do something else like i mean obviously i want him to like learn how to drive and all of that stuff that has to be done with his parents and because his parents are sick right now i don't know how we're gonna do that but i'm not sure if we should have river and star continue their feuding like i feel like they're both teenagers so they probably hold a really big grudge against each other against the whole salty debacle because river did tell star that uh he liked salty so i don't know i mean he's gonna he's gonna let them have their little relationship or whatever but for now you know he's gonna be watching from afar for sure it looks like meadow's plants are growing up here which is amazing i'm gonna have her go and water those uh using this swift grow station and oh also when you told me that i could put the banana down and i could plant it if i use move objects on so we're gonna come up here we're gonna plant this little banana seed i really wanted to plant it in the last episode so i'm gonna have her go up there and just do that um and then we do need to do a little bit oh she canceled it lovely i love when they're sick isn't it just so fun isn't it just so fun when they're sick and they cancel out everything that uh, i tell them to do oh i gotta love it gotta love sickness and not a specter i hate you sometimes okay so i'm never try and go and plant that banana seed let's see if she can't she's gonna cancel it i already know i'm our yep there there we go she's already canceling it okay lovely go plant that meadow all right plant that nope she just she just doesn't she just your sim is too stressed to do that okay who has a tab cast skip is it you okay go give meadow the tab cast we're gonna have her go and listen to cooking and then she can hopefully plant this seed she's being so annoying about it there we go okay finally lovely great how hard was that all you gotta do is like place it in the ground meadow okay so she's planted a banana tree i'm so excited so i think the bananas actually came with the sims 3 island paradise which is so exciting i love bananas um in real life and you know now that we can have a banana it's gonna be great okay i'm gonna have uh meadow go and can i compost a shell i didn't even think of that let's have her go and try and do that i wonder if we can do it oh use composter i don't i think it's because we don't have yeah we have items in there that can be composted which is the fucking shell so let me take that out does anyone else have any fish in their inventory no no one has any fish so unfortunately it does this count as a fish oh it does oh my god this counts as a fish okay i think i can have her go and do that can i yes the composter can be used with the uh with the thing that looks like a shell lovely great all right so i'm gonna have meadow go upstairs i don't know why the latin music is like on oh my god skip got over his element thank god oh my god oh and river's gonna be graduating in a couple days okay so maybe today what we should have them do is why don't we have skip go and teach his son how to drive because it says river's gonna be graduating in a couple days he's gonna be graduating in a couple days he has to learn how to drive eventually oh my god kennedy's writing paper bags good job kennedy proud of you kennedy used to be like our little author girl uh way back in university like wait before she even went to university she was writing book upon book upon book i swear she had more success writing books before university than she did like getting a career after university i don't know it's a it's a weird situation okay skip is very stressed out i'm gonna have him go and watch some tv because he just got over his sickness so that's why he's stressed out what is river doing river is eating some pancakes organic pancakes he doesn't need to eat i don't know why oh he's putting them away okay gotcha i'm gonna have meadow go and eat them pancakes eat them pancakes i mean eat the pancakes oh winona is purchasing properties <laughs> she bought a four bedroom two bathroom holy shit that is a huge house for what for just her i did just see that winona oh phoebe's to paradise made 417 see how much more money we made by placing that one item down kind of crazy tyson is just in such a bad mood he's tired he's hungry poor kid is stressed out like he's just not having a good childhood because he's been sick like 90 percent of it oh my god river's pissed because his dad is watching tv i was getting a little bit of lag here and there so i did a total ton reset so everyone's motives are gonna be reset now but i think my game should be running so much better i was getting like basically like 10 second lag i don't know why that was happening but anyway okay are people still sick are we still sick yes okay so tyson's still sick unfortunately meadow's still sick but who's not sick is skip and his son river so we're gonna have them go out here and he's gonna teach his son how to drive river has four days until he ages up so he's getting quite close okay my baby is growing up i'm gonna give skip the car and i'm gonna have river go over to his dad and be like hey dad um can you teach me how to drive can i ask him how to drive wait does he have to go up to his son and ask him or teach him how to drive maybe he doesn't have the car does he not have the car oh, i think river has to have the car right river has to have the car in order to go and use it right right yes um can i not do it why is this happening to me i can't have him ask him how to drive learn how to drive what the fuck so i'm getting no option teach how to drive that's so strange i can punish him <laughs> 
I don't want to punish him, though. I want to teach my son how to drive. What the hell? Ask for herbs. Is it just because he's a plant sim? I don't know. Maybe it's... Vac we can. Oh, we can vaccinate him. Go and vaccinate your son. Yes, go. Go vaccinate him on the side of the road. How lovely. He's gonna give him a little shot. Oh, oh my god. River has been successfully inoculated against the following diseases. Llama pox. Okay, cool. So I could have done it the entire time and the entire household would not be sick right now. Um, But yeah, thanks, Skip, for vaccinating your son. <laughs> can I... Can he self-vaccinate? Wouldn't that be cool? Oh, we can signal. Oh, we can signal mermaid by clicking on him. Cool. Okay, so I don't see an option to teach him how to drive for whatever it's like he can already go and use the car but he can't though he can't you need to learn how to drive first yeah no shit how am i gonna do it if i can't click on him and do it so i'm thinking maybe the problem is happening because the car isn't out in like a plot it's in someone's inventory and i have tried it with both us uh, with the car in both skip's inventory and river's inventory so i don't know why this is happening why the option is not appearing but what i was trying to do is i was trying to find a place in town where there is a car plot like maybe a public lot or something but all these lots don't don't have cars plots at them because obviously this is a world that is entirely accessible by boat um so none of these like if you look at any of these public lots none of them have places for cars to be parked or anything like that which is unfortunate because it's causing a problem because i obviously need to have that car plot out or that car in a parking spot but yeah i just think river's not gonna be able to learn how to drive which in all honesty i feel like is kind of realistic in the first place because think about it i mean this world is like boat driven boat everything is by boat so it makes it makes sense that we can't um do that can i have him maybe give her or we can have him vaccinate her <laughs> i don't think it's gonna do anything now here's meadow's brand new outfit by the way the stress is from roller rolls before you guys ask it's on my tumblr my sims 3 cc finds tumblr so if you are interested meadow is already fully inoculated for all the diseases you know about he uh gave her a little vaccination and then she gave him a kiss how cute is that so what should we have river do on this fine sunday i feel like he really likes to learn athletic skills so maybe we'll send him off to the gym maybe he'll meet someone at the gym i don't know i also don't know like maybe he doesn't need maybe his first girlfriend doesn't need to be a mermaid maybe we can have him just date around you know date like regular people because he himself is an occult and i feel like when you're younger you try to go with the flow and like not stand out and maybe he wants like that normalcy maybe he wants someone that isn't you know completely an occult like he is so just an interesting thought i guess i guess i'm gonna cancel out um teach river how to drive because for some reason it's not working maybe someone in the comments will know you guys seem to have all the answers that's why that's why i say that <laughs> anyway who did want to hang out today two people that did want to hang out today is tyson and his dad so i'm gonna have tyson go down here meadow and skip are just like macking on each other in the fucking living room i'm gonna have skip go out with his son because he did want to hang out with his dad and also he wanted to go to a public pool so yeah he has a wish to go to a public pool i don't know why these sims want to go to a public pool when they literally live in a world surrounded by ocean I, I can't tell you i don't know but we're gonna have them both go there honestly he's probably gonna cancel it out because he's sick so i guess we'll see how far he gets meadow is like grabbing her stomach are you okay girl i'm never gonna watch some tv she's still feeling under the weather so i guess we can just send her to you know chill and watch some tv anyway river's over here at the gym right now let's see if there's anybody interesting anybody um that is cute here i don't know i need to see like the town teenagers actually before we like do anything further i just want to take a peek at who they are so i'm gonna go to age we're gonna choose teen there's only 10 teenagers in this town thus far and two of them i already know are taken star and salty and one of them's his family member so ew um we have oh lily liliana atacha emily hamada christabel collins ashley alto posh has been talking a lot about ashley alto so i have to check her out and shondell scott so th these are the options that we have i really like liliana atacha she looks cute to me i mean one of you was saying that river seems like he's more like 14 rather than star and salty who seem to be like more like 17 ish so it would have been weird in the first place had river been dating her why are you trying what is this old man you just kicked me off the fucking equipment you asshole get away from me get away get away <laughs> yeah get shit on ruben yeah you're mad you're mad as fuck okay is there anyone here we have a pregnant woman ray is here is uh he's still yeah i gotta keep an eye on tyson to make sure he's still going with his dad look he canceled it he canceled it i predicted he would cancel it i fucking knew it yeah skip your son just he 
he's not there. He's just not there. Okay, we're gonna have to send them separately, I think, because he's just canceling things out. What do we expect at this point? I mean, honestly, he's gonna ride his little bike over there. All right, so, I mean, at least we're doing productive things in this episode, right? We're having him work on his athletic skill. We're having Tyson hang out with his daddy-o that he hasn't hung out with in a really long time. This is like a pairing and like kind of like a subplot, I feel like. We'd never have Tyson and Skip or like we'd never do anything with Tyson, period. Skip is already, he's already in the pool. I'm gonna have him, I'm gonna have Tyson go and make a big splash in there. He's got his little flippers on. I love these flippers so much. They come with Island Paradise. They're so cute, so adorable. I'm gonna have him go and take a big splash in there. I'm gonna have his dad go and, you know, swim in there. We have him do like an underwater contest. I feel like Skip would definitely win the underwater breathing contest because, I mean, he's a diver. Like it just, it only makes sense, right? Get off your phone go and hang out with your son what are you doing what a cute like father son day this is adorable let's go and do a hold breath contest that seems nice go hold your breath with your dad yes 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 and tyson loves swimming he has the wonderful water little mula down here sims that the loves to swim trait can't get enough of being in cool waters and obviously as it says he has that because he has the love to swim trait let's see who wins oh skip skip lost are you serious dude you are literally a diver you dive underwater and you lost how is that possible yes Tyson. I, I can't believe you won that too, dude. I'm honestly shocked. I'm gonna have Skip and Tyson just um, hang out over here. Oh, I think one of the town's teenagers is here. Omar, right? Yes, Omar. So this is one of the teenagers. Maybe we should send River over here. He needs some friends. He's cute. He's got a cute face. Who are his parents? I would like to see that. His parents are, oh my god, they've been going crazy. Oh, he's dating Liliana. He's dating Liliana, who is I was interested in the first place. I actually want to look at Liliana because I think she's really pretty. And she might be a, um, I think she's a, a in town when she comes as a child but she's like aged up since then because now she's a teenager so let's see her oh i mean she was cuter in the um little portrait right here she's not really i mean and eh. she's not that pretty here she also has that um i can't tell i honestly i literally can't tell if she got auto generated to age up and look like this because i mean this outfit like is really good i i mean i think she did because she's wearing converse i don't think ea would give her converse to wear but it does match they do match like the dress i cannot tell this is like one of the rare times where i'm like like, did EA randomly generate her this outfit or did they like hand select this stuff? I cannot tell. But yeah, this is Liliana. She's cute. Um, She's really cute, actually. I don't know who her parents are. I guess we would have to look. I it just showed me a way, I think, in the family tree when I clicked on Omar. I think it showed. Oh, okay. It canceled out. So Liliana's parents are... Gu oh, I know how to say this. Guermo. Great. Guermo. <laughs> Guermo, I think is how you say that. Uh, Itacha, and apparently she has like roots to dead people in town, which I love this about The Sims 3 is like, I can follow her family tree all the way up. It's so cool. Did you guys know that Guermo is William? That's like the translation of the name William. Isn't that cool? Don't ask me how they made William from Guermo. Like, I, I don't know. But yeah, I butchered that name too, the pronunciation. You don't have to tell me. I know. Okay, I know. So Meadow's just here. She's chilling out. I'm gonna have her drink some tea or something. I kind of, I don't know if like the tea in the game makes sims feel better i literally don't know uh, but if so we definitely need like a, a tea maker or something of that sort didn't there isn't there like a tea maker in one of the wait is that from sims 4 oh, no here it is or am i thinking about sims 4 i think i'm thinking about sims 4 why is my brain thinking about sims 4 so strange i'm gonna have her go and drink a chai chai is tea but in the game like they don't realize that her outfit is so cute she looks like really young though um, and she's probably in her mid-30s. Maybe we just say Meadow's like stylish. She's just got that stylish jean. She's gonna go and drink some, some hot tea. I love this. This is just like a family day. They're enjoying the last days of the hot weather. Although it's only 55. I would assume this pool would have to be heated for Tyson to swim around when it's like 55. That's really cold, actually. I don't know if I'd want to swim around when it's like 55. Oh, ew. Seems very chilly. Well, this is a cute like father someday. He just belly flopped. It looks so painful. Any interesting Sims here? Any Sims of no? Oh, this is a cute guy wait 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 wait. who are you hello this is devon haunt actually he he looked better he looked better <laughs> from far away i will say anyone else any other girls here no i need to you know what i need to do is i need to make like a teen hangout location and then anytime like i send river to go to um, a teen hangout location or tyson because tyson's gonna age up shortly too maybe we can just summon them over with enros because as it is right now like they are all spread around town it is hard to find a central location where we can just find and it's straight up teenagers because obviously we need to be more than the town teenagers. I guess school would probably be the best option. We should see if he knows any of the town. Oh, he does. He knows, um, what's her name? Shondell. He knows Shondell. He knows Blanca, who is, I think she's an NPC because she wasn't showing up when I had like the invite over menu 
open so she must be an npc um but yeah the rest of them like emily liliana obviously we already saw i don't know where liliana is she's wearing a bathing suit right now so maybe she's at like the pool i mean we just were at the pool she wasn't there so clearly she's not but i don't know meadow's just at home she's doing she's doing some work around the house sparing her little sick self from being outside here i think i might have her go take a nap because she's like kind of tired so let's have her go nap i also think it's about time to send tyson and skip home maybe we can have them go and um hang out a little bit more because they haven't actually talked like they've just been swimming around each other so i'm gonna have them get out of the water and interact a little bit because this is like weird they spent the entire day together but they didn't get the relationship up at all which is kind of unfortunate so i'm gonna have him go and talk to his son let's just have him go and tell him a joke hug him gossip with him i don't want to like queue up too many interactions because i think tyson may cancel them out because he is sick so I'm gonna like go slowly here about his day talk about a new planet name that's cute does he just have that interaction because he's a planet sim that's cool talk about movies let's go and be funny with him make silly face tell funny story talk about movies again i guess just do a bunch of shit i wonder maybe is there a movie showing right now that we can go and see there is okay we gotta go quick we gotta go really quick this is such like a cute father sunday i love this so much okay go and attend the movie go and attend um sharks on land how fitting that we're seeing that movie when we live in isla paradiso very nice okay guys stop talking stop talking go go see sharks on land i gotta make sure tyson doesn't fucking cancel it out because this little shit will i don't know when this movie started but i think we're pretty late to going to go and see it okay get in there get in there guys go 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 see go see the movie go yes they made it in oh uh, what a no what are you doing skip go back in what the fuck oh my god that's so annoying why why do you do this stop i wonder there has to be something in enros that lets me turn off the Q canceling when they're what they're just it's like a revolving door what is wrong with you guys are you guys okay can they not go in together do they ha they have to be in a group that's the real question okay well i mean he got in i don't know why his dad didn't get in i guess we'll have him go separately that's so strange okay go see a little movie saw a terrible action movie like you already saw it shut up before i go any further let me check in and ross vector if there's anything that will stop them from canceling the queue it is so annoying okay there's nothing in here that will stop that uh does diseases uh llama pox no let's just turn it on and off enabled yes yes everything's enabled yeah so there is nothing to turn off that queue canceling that's just something i have to deal with that's actually so annoying uh, i love that i can start an outbreak though i could just cause massive what is this what what oh he's dehydrated because he's been at the gym all day right okay lovely i'm gonna have him quickly push himself and then he can go take a shower after he's done with that because he needs you know he, he's got to get his shit ripped he's got to be ripped for the next season for the up upcoming season i say the upcoming season like it's not about to be fall and 40 degrees outside that's crazy okay come on you can do it there we go level six very nice good job river i'm gonna buy him um uh, faster learner if i can i think i oh no but how much Fifteen thousand. he's to get faster learner okay we're almost there lots of sims here at the gym today anyone of interest anyone that i would be interested in dating perhaps uh no they're all like old people why do the teenagers not come to the gym like that seems like a place where teenagers would be but they're never Never here they're just never here i guess i don't know so he is pumped so i think when they get this pumped mood that i'm pretty sure that means that they've gained a little bit of muscle mass like if i were to take him in cast he would be um a little bit buffer than like the regular sim or like what he started at so he's gonna go take a shower star is getting reset i don't know what it is with like sims in this town but they are getting reset like crazy and every time they do it's like i get a little bit of lag so it's kind of it's kind of annoying i will say we're taking a shower in this crappy little shower he did want to go and win a game against salty she's never home like she is never home she's always out and about doing things in her life must be nice <laughs> maybe i could have him buy like a baseball or something i mean i'm sure that's what he wants right to play fucking baseball with her but it would complete that wish i don't know i feel like he should probably keep away from her for now because he doesn't want to like reopen the the wound you know of <laughs> his heart getting shattered by his cousin i'm gonna send him on home though he had a good he had a good run at the gym um it was nice it was a nice little time okay and his sickness caused him to cancel out seeing the movie which is just lovely but skip had a good time he saw a great action movie uh, i don't know why it didn't oh he saw a great okay he saw a great action movie too lovely all right good we're good then i lied it didn't cancel it out he saw the entire movie so i'm gonna send him home he's very tired because he's sick and it's about time for him to go and do that oh also um we're not gonna send skip home though skip is not gonna go home yet since he's no longer sick anymore which is gonna be really nice we can have him go and scuba dive at rocky reef and see if that mod that i installed before this episode see if that works so he can actually go 
and use the underwater caves, which will be really nice. The river just got, how did he get script error reset? What the fuck? No one in my game is like spared from the script errors. It's just everybody. Everybody and their mother is just getting a script error, it seems. All right, so Skip just pulled up over the dive location, which is gonna be exciting. I'm excited. We're not gonna have him spend too long down here. Um, Just for the simple fact that his energy is getting low. He's hungry, so it's not gonna be the best dive, but we'll try, we'll try. I'm also gonna have him catch some more fish so that when Meadow goes to fertilize her plants, uh, she has something she can use, which will be nice. And he got a level three in scuba diving, which is amazing. That's exactly what we need. Perfect. Catching some alley fish. He has this little breathing comfortably, which is nice. So we have three hours to spend down here with him, which should work out perfectly because that's probably when his energy and hunger will get low. That'll just like auto boot him to the surface. So yeah, we'll be, we'll try. We'll try and speed this up here. Oh my God. He is so tired. Poor Tyson. He's just in an awful mood. Someone set a booby trap on the fucking bench he's sleeping on. <laughs> I think that's right outside of our house. House. I think that's why uh, that poopy trap is there. Probably River or somebody. Tyson might have even set it up himself. I don't know. Okay, I'm just having him catch all of these squids and stuff like that. This might be like the best way to catch fish, honestly. If your sim has no fishing skill, is just having them come down here. Because I've gotten like five in a matter of like 10 sim minutes, which is great. It's great. Okay, so I'm gonna catch these two more fish and then we're gonna have them go and try this cave finally. Oh, actually, before I do it, I think I do need to go and debug enabler and reset it. That's something that Shimrod said on the description of the mod so i'm gonna just i'm gonna reset it. i think there's two down here isn't there two? Oh my god the camera's like whipping around and there's actually two so let me try with both of them just in case i click on like the other one and like it resets him i'll be so confused okay so i reset both of the caves that's that's good now we're gonna have skip go over it and just go and explore let's see if he can go and do it i hope so okay here we go here we go here we go i'm so excited oh my god what if he gets like dead <laughs> i don't think they can die in these wait they might be able to i'm not sure it might be like a really low percentage that they die I think it is low percentage. Okay, so he's gonna try and go in there. Let's see if it will work for the first time. First time, we'll let him in. <gasps> oh my God, it's letting him in. It's letting him in. He's in, he's in guys, the mod works. Oh my God, Shimrod, you are a genius. Yes, he did it. He's in his first cave. I'm so proud. I am so fucking proud. Okay, so we're gonna let Skip go in there. He's exploring the depths of the cave right now. He found an air pocket in the cave, which means that his little mood down here, that will reset. It says floating through that cave felt like flying. If the sky was permanently dark and freezing and had fish trying to eat you, sounds spooky. Deep in the cave, Skip spied a herd of seahorses engaged in the latest viral dance craze. Man, that thing's everywhere now. Skip Taylor may have found another exit, but doesn't have enough skill to know for sure. Try increasing your diving skill first, then exploring this cave again. So that is a reference to Davy Jones's locker, which is the first, which actually that's the next cave that we can explore. I'm going to Skip go over to this other cave that's like next to this, and we'll try and explore that. We'll see if there's anything that he can get from there. But wow, Shimron, you are a genius. You fixed the cave problem, which is amazing. Oh my God, I'm so happy. So my caves are finally functional. Isn't that lovely? Oh, he can't get to the entrance. Uh, should I try again? Or can he just not get to it? Okay, I might have moved it like too close or something when I went to go pick it up in the last episode, which is what someone suggested, but it didn't end up working. So anyway, yeah, he can't get in there. I might have to move that one around, but oh my God, I'm so happy. Okay, so we did it. We finally explored the caves. Isn't that exciting? Wow, I feel so completed. I honestly feel so completed. And Skip found a second exit um, and he also found a ruby, which I guess is like a gem. Yeah, he found like a little uh, gem ruby or something like that, which is valued at 33 simoleons. Wow, we're really raking in the big bucks. 33 simoleons huh but i guess at this point it's literally just having skip like go diving and just having him improve his skill and that's how we're gonna get to that next diving location so yeah he's about to actually get another skill point in diving which is amazing about to be level four i think level five is when they unlock that next location so that should be that should be good i'm not sure if i should have him keep exploring the cave i'm not sure if that's a good idea uh just because i mean it will reset his breathing comfortably mullet which might be the only benefit to sending him down here and keep exploring those caves even though there's nothing really he can get from him oh he can now scuba dive at davy jones okay perfect wow that's ironic that we just unlocked that and i was just saying that we need to wait till our next skill level and i sent him in there okay perfect so we'll see if he gets booted over uh to that next lot and i guess that's a cliffhanger we'll have to leave the next episode at come on dude find find a breathing pocket quickly he has 20 minutes left on his 
Moodlet down here. I'm scared that he's not going to be able to go to the next location. Okay, lovely. He found an air pocket. Wow. Just everything is happening at perfect timing today, I must say. He is super hungry, so we're probably going to have to call it quits here in a second. Just want to get him over to exploring that lot. Have him booted out to the other side. Oh my god, Azul aged up. Wow. So Sophie and Kennedy's twins must have aged up because Azul aged up. Oh, it says he doesn't have enough skill. Okay. It might be the other cave, the one that he can't get into. I might have to like, go in to buy. Oh, oh my god, he got pulled in by the tentacles. Oh god. Okay, he made it. He's good. Suckered. He got suckered from the cave monster. Oh my god. Okay. Ow, ow. Those suckered marks sting. So while exploring, Skip found a second exit, which we already know. Um, and yes, Ursula and Azul did age up, which is just, I'm so excited for Tyson to be able to spend time with his cousins. He's got little fellow aliens along with him. It's gonna be great. I can't believe he got beat up again. He's just, he can't catch a break. A couple episodes ago, he got attacked by a shark. Now he got captured by those tentacles. It's just, it's a whole ordeal, okay? It's just a whole ordeal. Anyways, guys, it looks like Wall has finally set in to Isla Paradiso. It's so weird to see like trees changing and all that sort of stuff. It's cool. It's definitely cool. It makes for like a weird ambience in Isla Paradiso. I don't know, because you think of like tropical island, don't think of like trees changing color and all that. Anyways, guys, if you did like this episode, there is a lot more where this has come from. So sub to the channel. I'm gonna try and continuously upload like three a week if I can uh, now that I'm back at home away from college It's just lovely and yeah, I will see you guys all in the next one and peace out